Welcome back to Little Bayou Homestead, y'all. Today, I am going to show you guys what I was talking about. Let me move over here with this gore, okay? This gore is getting big enough. Well, let me turn my camera right the correct way. This gore is getting big enough and heavy enough that it's starting to pull. So, this is a strong plant, but still and all. This is what I did. You can do with any nylon, knee high, whatever. You know, as long as it's nylon. I took a footy, okay? It's a sandal footy nylon. You can cut, just cut you a hole right there with a pair of scissors, nothing fancy, and tie you some strings, which my string, I'm gonna be able to adjust it, you know, as the gore grows. So I'm gonna put this on here and I'll show you guys what I'm saying. Okay, as you can see, it's real simple. You cut your strings. I mean, this is just to give it, see, it's not pulling on that vine as hard as it was. It's giving them some kind of leeway there. So, I mean, it's nothing fancy. It is something that works. And you can always, which I, I think I cut mine maybe a little bit too short for my wire length. But that's no problem. You can change that wire out. Sorry, the rope. Um, yeah. I'm going to say that's about two pounds so far. But just tie it up. You can see. Tie it up and you can take it loose as it grows. Just so it won't break off your, your vine there. And, yep, we're working on another bed over there, y'all. That is a four by... 16 is what it is uh, It rained all day uh, That is two scoops of uh, Dirt and We didn't get none for the rest of the day to work with because it was raining very heavily today So yeah, I'm gonna do a video on how this is uh, put together. It's not expensive y'all I didn't even use a nail, okay? It's real easy. I think a lot of people are doing it this way because it's, I think the wood is a little bit, you know, pricey. I think I paid um, $15 for, uh, that's an eight by uh, 12, yeah. So, so it would be one, two, three, four, and that would be five total of those boards. And I've got, two four six eight ten twelve of the blocks and see the wood just fits down in the slots there and of course if you're going to use any kind of rod on or anything you can put it in there to stabilize it I don't see any reason for me to do it because my yards pretty flat so it's okay but yep that's it y'all I just wanted to show y'all about the gore and my ongoing project which um, we're getting ready to do our peas which will be pink eye peas and we're going to do our turnips our purple tops so we're ready really ready to get that going so we'll see y'all next video if you would please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and like and share if you would i appreciate that see you next video keep canning and keep eating good see ya